My people, welcome to Studio Camouflage. Today, we are going to replace a flex cable for the DJI Phantom 3. If you're in Kenya and you have a drone and you want to do this, then this video is for you. You can also visit our offices at Zahara Gardens and just hang along. So let's keep it going. We want to replace this cable real quick. First of all, you need to get your tools in order. For me, what I usually use, I use a pen and a paper, a set of screwdrivers and tweezers. Those are the three essential tools that you need. I draw every part that I'm going to disassemble and place it over the paper with its screws. The first thing that I have to do is to remove the base plate. There's a certain small plastic with two screws that goes off fast. Then, then here is the base plate and I'll put it on paper where I did, I did draw it. Once I put it there, I try and arrange all screws in order. I normally open the camera first. No, I do open the camera last. So I guess the next thing that we we'll have to do here is to open the motor. But before we do the motor, there are two screws that connect to the base plate. I guess the next thing that we'll have to do is the motor. We'll have to remove the four screws of the motor. And before we do even the motor, there are two connectors that are at the base plate motherboard that you have to remove. Then you have to also be keen as you remove the connectors and get down the get down the what what is it called the flex cable from the motherboard just lift up the lock and pull them out gently now you can easily lift up the board and you'll see a connector underneath the board there's also another connector cable that is attaching the board to the system so you have to be real careful you can now remove the other side of the motor. It's almost the same side, just for systematic purposes. This other side comes first so that you can get access to the flex cable as it runs through the round part. Okay, the last part that I normally remove is the camera. So for me, I do the camera last and uh, I do it fast, just repeating the same system all over in a backward manner that is why i have to write it down on on paper So as you start assembling the camera, you have to roll the flex cable around twice and get it to the motor. Tie the other side of the motor and roll it to the base plate. This other side of the motor comes with the two screws that you have to adjust to the camera. Make sure when you're fitting the camera, the flat side is underneath as the camera faces up. You can use your tweezers now to connect and press the lock of the connector then take it round and make sure roll it over and once you come back to this other side you can now place your last cables on the base plate the main motherboard
fit on the camera to the drone and test it.